Stephen. Ollie Deeks here. And um, we've got a special guest. We've got, got a special a guest. Of Ollie. What? What? Who? Who's this? Hi guys, uh, I'm Josh, Ollie's twin brother. Wow. Hello, Josh. Hi, Stephen. Josh, Josh, you've been in uh, in one of our videos before, haven't you? We did a uh, twin twin challenge. I uh, have, yes. We set a challenge for Stephen. Uh, Stephen. <laughs> Stephen. <laughs> <laughs> Stephen, challenge him to guess whose voice was who when speaking. Uh, anyway, Josh, you've got the challenge for us today, haven't you? I have, yes. This is a, a challenge that I have created myself. This challenge is what I like to call Bible Golf. Boys, welcome to Bible Golf. This is your Monday challenge. Um, it's quite as simple as a game. First of all, you need a Bible. Do you both have a, your Bibles with you? I sure do. Got my Bible. I do indeed. Rule number one is how to tee off. Um, so we're going to play four holes, um, and the way to tee off each hole is by first of all beginning with your Bible closed, and then to tee off you basically need to turn to a page in the Bible. But to take a stroke you need to make sure that you, you don't flick to a page, you turn directly to that page. Of course each turn you make counts as a stroke, so you want to take as little strokes as you can. Rule number three is if you turn to any other psalm, so if you hit any psalms, um, you have hit a bunker I'm afraid and that is plus one stroke. If you hit, turn to a book beginning with the letter T, um, you have also hit the rough and that means that is plus one stroke as well. And the final rule, caddy rule. So I am your caddy and basically if you are really struggling to find um, the verse, you can ask assistance from me and I will provide you with directions of how to get to that hole. You kind of use your caddy once per hole, it counts as a plus one stroke as well. Do you understand the rules, guys? I do indeed. Got it, mate. Perfect. Well, let us begin Bible golf. This placemat. Um, Stephen, could you call for it, whether it's going to land on pig or brown? Okay. Pig. Pig. It's pig. Yes. So Stephen, you have a choice if you want to tee off first or let all Ollie tee off. So as you can see, hole one. So Stephen, if you'd like to tee us off, please. First stroke. Acts 27. Okay, ready? Uh, uh, Luke. Oh, oh no, Thessalonians. Uh, hey! hey. You have hit a bunker. Was it a rough? No, you've hit the rough. So hit the rough plus one. Plus, plus, plus one stroke. Holly, stroke number two. Stroke number two. Romans. Stephen. Two Corinthians. Oh, I get in there. Yeah. So Holly, this is stroke number three. Colossians. Oh my gosh, I was literally. Ooh. So close to Thessalonians. <laughs> Stephen. Galatians 6. <laughs> right, I, think I, I think I overshot the hole there, so I'm going backwards. Galatians. I'm just going to go one page of the home. Come on, boys, you need to get on the green now. Ephesians 2, verse 10. Uh, For we are God's handiwork, created in Christ Jesus to go to. to to do good works which God prepared in advance for us to do. Well, it's Steven, that was, you took that in six strokes, even your player one. Uh, Any player one. Oh no, that means, oh sorry, no, you got two. <laughs> Not 62. <laughs> <laughs> Let me put an S there. He does have a degree in theology. <laughs> and Ollie, there. Ollie, if you lose, you cannot hold my degree against me. <laughs> I've got a degree in PE, mate. Right. <laughs> Ollie, shot number yeah, so five to be... But turning up pages. Here we go. Oh, Ephesians. Uh, Ephesians introduction. <laughs> oh, okay. That's, this is to tie the hole with Stephen for a double bogey. Ephesians 2, verse 10. And this is from the Good News Bible. God has made us what we are, and in our union with Christ Jesus, he has created us for a life of good deeds, which he has already prepared for us to do. Two. Tie from the first hole. Come on. Okay. 
because it's a tie. Uh, who teed off first? Oh, Stephen. Stephen Ollie did, yeah. Tee off because you tied. Um, yeah. I want you to tee off as close as you can to Zephaniah. 317. I've increased the par on this one because I think it's a diff more of a difficult book to turn to. So, Definitely. Ollie, if you'd like, if you'd like to turn it, tee us off. Okay. Where the heck is it? Remember, yeah. don't forget, if you need to use your caddy, don't forget to use your caddy. I might be using it. Okay. Um, I've hit a psalm. <laughs> <laughs> right, you've hit the water, so that's plus one stroke. Daniel. Ollie, you need to chip this out of the... Uh, um, the bunker. Okay, here we go. Whoosh! No! I'm still in the Psalms! <laughs> He's in straight back in the bunker. Zechariah. Oh, Zechariah. Oh, I don't know where I'm going with it, though. That's the trouble. I don't you know, know who I Okay. I'm in Song of Songs. Okay. Oh, Matthew. Song okay, this is, that. this is stroke number six for you, Ollie. Isaiah. I'm in Isaiah. Oh, back in Zechariah. I'm guessing here, but I'm thinking it's this way. Actually, no, I think I need a bit more. Okay. Jeremiah. Jeremiah. Jeremiah was a bullfrog. Uh, stroke number five for you, Stephen. Uh, I've ended up at the very back end of Malachi. Oh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna use my caddy. Oh, use your caddy. Okay, Stephen. Okay, well, I, I'm gonna mute my laptop. Okay, right, caddy. Okay, Caddy, so where are you at the moment? I'm in Jeremiah. You are in Jeremiah. Okay, Zephaniah is... Is he a minor prophet? Yes, minor prophet in the Old Testament, but it's towards the end of the Old Testament. Right. Um, it is the one, two, three, four book from the back from the Old Testament. Um, it's in between Haggakuk and Habakkuk. Hey, Caddy has provided a shot for you, so that counts as a stroke of prey. Stephen, your shot. This far. Oh, Zachariah again. <laughs> <laughs> you love Zachariah, Stephen. I'm going. Go for it. Amos. Amos. Josh, I'm going to use my caddy. You're going to use the caddy. You are so close, Stephen. Um, yeah. You, so the Zechariah, then it's Haggai, and then it's Zephaniah. So okay. you want to go towards, obviously, towards Genesis that way. Okay. So Ollie, this is stroke number 11 for you. For a triple bogey. <gasps> Habakkuk. Oh, oh. Okay. Zephaniah 1. Oh, oh no. he's, he's, on he's on the green. Ready? Oh, I'm in Zechariah. <laughs> <laughs> Zechariah. I'm going to turn one page. Zephaniah 3, verse 17. The Lord of God is with you, the mighty warrior who saves. He will take great delight in you. In his love, he will no longer rebuke you, but will rejoice over you with singing. So you hit that in 10 strokes, which means you hit a double bogey. You have hit, hit two bunkers to begin. Oh, Zephaniah one. Oh. Come on, Al, you're on the green. You're on the green. Help is just the next page. Can I put it in? No. <laughs> he's missed the green. I've oh, got, I've missed got Zephaniah. Hole. I've got Zephaniah three fifty. Okay, one more. Turn over the page. Oh, Zephaniah three seventeen. The Lord your God is with you. His His power gives you victory. The Lord will take delight in you, and in His love He will give you new life. He will sing and be joyful over you. Ollie, you put that in 15 strokes, which means you are seven over par. Okay, Stephen, we're moving on to hole number three. It's a beautiful part of the course. Nice and short. I want you to hit Proverbs 3, 6. Stephen, tears off, please. Song of songs. Oosh. I've hit the Psalms again. <laughs> Job. Job. I'm so I, lost. I have my thumb in the place I'm going to turn. No! My Psalms! No! Oh, oh I'm in Psalms again. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Isaiah. Yay, Proverbs! He's on the green. Counting for you, Ollie. Okay, Stephen. 
I'm also on Proverbs 25. Oh, they're both on the green. Oh, Proverbs 15. Proverbs 13. They're not, they're not putting very well on the green. Oh, Proverbs 11. I'm just so scared I'm going to hit the Psalms again. <laughs> oh, Proverbs 11, come on. Stroke number nine. Hey, Proverbs 3, verse 6. Remember the Lord Very good. you do, and he will show you the right way. Ollie, okay. you got it in nine, which means you are four. Okay, Stephen. Proverbs 3, verse 6. Oh. In all your ways, submit him, and he will make your path straight. That's a tied hole. For the final hole, Deuteronomy 31, verse 6. Stephen, would you like to see us up, please? I shall do. Leviticus 6. 2, 2 Samuel. Oh, one Samuel. Deuteronomy 15. Oh. oh, one Samuel. I've just missed it again. Oh, dear. <laughs> Can't get out of it. Okay, Stephen, you're on the 26. Good approach play. Two pages the next time. How's that happen? I'm still in one Samuel. <laughs> just got a couple of pages here. Oh, Deuteronomy 28. Judges. A couple of pages again. Deuteronomy 31, verse 6. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. What a shot. He's put it in for six. One over par, so that's a bogey. Hey, Deuteronomy. <laughs> Deuteronomy 23. Deuteronomy 31 verse 6. Be determined and confident. Do not be afraid of them. Your God, the Lord himself, will be with, will be with you. He will not fail you or abandon you. Uh, I'm afraid you uh, hit that in for, for eight, which means you are three. Triple bogey. Work out. Total 16. Nine. Stephen, you are the Bible golf first ever Bible golf champion. Fantastic. Well, I shall, I shall bask in my victory. Uh, fantastic. Holly, maybe you should pick up your Bible a little bit more. I should have no defence. And uh, this is just me being a sore loser, as we know, Stephen. But I do use my mobile phone for my Bible. I think that is a defence. You know, I, I think in, in the event that you were kidnapped by a, uh, an anti-Christian state, and you had no access to the, you know, you had no access to your phone, all that kind of thing. You know, if someone said to you, where, where is this book in the Bible? I, I can get you that page. You know, what page number am I going to? You could, you know, if you knew your Bible better, you could say, rip me out page 300. <laughs> Steve, is this, is this a scenario you play in your head quite a lot, Stephen? <laughs> no, it's not. Not at all. <laughs> Josh, 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 can we, can we, can we make this clear that you, that you invented, invented this game? game? Yes, yes, we'll make it clear by, by saying, I invented this game. game. Why are we 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 we? I think we had better say goodbye. Fantastic. For now. Well, thank, well, you thank you very much, Josh. Thank you very much, Josh. Uh, uh, some point uh, soon. Uh, and yeah. to the rest uh, of you, uh, 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 Mondays, uh, we hope this is bright enough for Mondays, but Mondays are Italian, especially when you work with Ollie. When you work with me, trying to play Bible golf, because I've just... Just, I just go around the golf course. Oh, Victor, oh, Victor, it's goodbye from me. And from your sore loser? It's goodbye from him. And from your humble caddy, goodbye. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Bye.